Good morning. How you doing? Watching. <laughs> uh, let's see. It's Monday morning. <sighs> Time to get to work. Actually, I'm going to be stuck in the middle of a windstorm in a minute. This is like the calm before the, the storm. So it's going to be a very windy day today, and that's a wonderful thing about the desert. It gets so windy. That the thing about being outdoors that I love is that, that the storms. When you're in your vehicle and you're set and you're just sitting there waiting, you know, ride it out, it's kind of amazing. Like when I was at Cape Disappointment, I was just really, is it just a northern, northeastern storm or whatever we call them? Storm came rolling in and deer, it was like in the middle of the night and deer were just like walking around my vehicle. Just like wind was blowing, I thought tree tree branches were gonna hit my vehicle. It was like pretty hairy, but the deer just could give a shit. They were just walking around. It was beautiful. I would like to explain the title of my last um, video, "Too Ugly to Prostitute." Um, my buddy James. The reason why I brought up my buddy James, the the famous hobo, the rambler, is because he he told me that he goes one of his most famous signs because he'll just sit on the corner and. He'll write stuff on signs, and he won't ask for money. He'll just write stuff on signs, and people give him money just because they laugh, because it makes him funny. But, yeah, he put that on a sign, and, you know, he, people loved it. He thought, man, I got so much money from that. Just people laugh, and then they're like, here, here's money. Because James is a, looks like a big biker, big heavy set biker, burly dude, beard and all. Yeah, so that's why it's, it's pretty ironically funny. But he's, you know, he's a handsome man. I love you, James. Hope you're doing good. But yeah, I'm just hanging out before the storm hits and you can see it rolling in over there a little bit. And that's Mount Whitney. And yeah, it's kind of beautiful right now except for that generator over there. And this is Mount Whitney. It actually looks kind of cool. It's turned out pretty decent. And I'm not quite done with it. I need to do a couple more rock formations and stuff like that. But yeah, not bad. That's just a pretty face, right? Anyway. Ah. <sighs> Hope you're having a wonderful day. Hope you have a wonderful day. Wherever you are in the world. And yeah, I love you. God loves you. And the universe is just really, really digging you right now. So I think you should rock it. Do what you gotta do. Have a wonderful day. Love yourself. Number one, look in the mirror and say, you are awesome. You are amazing. You are the most coolest human. I'd do that. It's like a fake it till you make it, right? You just convince yourself that you're the most amazing human being in the world. You're the emperor or empress of your universe. Just do it. Get in the mirror and just go. Love yourself. I mean, go easy, babe. But, you know, don't go blind, but love yourself, okay? Just because nobody's going to love you more than you. And that's the truth. I mean, if you find somebody that loves you more than they love themselves, and you love them more than you love yourself, it's going to be amazing. But that's rare. But you know, it happens. I love you. I already said that, didn't I? It was such a blur. Anyway, I won't let you go. I'm going to give you a little bit of slides. Of, you know, what I'm dealing with. There's a cool rock formation. Anyway, love you. Have a wonderful day. Again with the